the night that he sold it to Hanks, he, uh, Ambrose gave me a call. He's all excited. And he said he has some wonderful news. And he says, Dick, I sold the rights to the Band of Brothers to Tom Hanks under one condition, that he does not play your part because he's too old. So that was his big joke for that <laughs> moment. And uh, we shared that and uh, went on from there. And of course, part of the story on Band of Brothers is when we were on the line and we had the, uh, the, the Nylon boys contact us, they were friends. They were in the 82nd Airborne. And uh, so we got the, that's part of the, that memory, that story combined with Band of Brothers. And the spinoff of that, of course, ended up with uh, Saving Private Ryan. And uh, in the premiere for it, which I was invited to go to and took my good friend Bob Hoffman with me and from Lebanon. And uh, during that, uh, there was a premiere before the premiere at one of the studios. And uh, we were invited to go to this premiere. And uh, also the Nylon family was there at the same time. So at that time, we had the opportunity to meet the family. It was very nice. and. Uh, then, of course, the next night was the premiere. Mm -hmm. I, I've heard people comment that Hanks and Spielberg were true gentlemen, that they're pleasant, pleasant to do them. business with. And right. I, I think that goes a long way to distill some of the problems we have with some people in Hollywood, that yeah. uh, these two guys were true gentlemen. They're true gentlemen. And at the premiere, of course, had the opportunity to visit with Hanks and Spielberg and... Uh, It's very nice. Good.